Welcome back, everybody, to Falcon Place Neo Scavenger episode number five, which obviously means one thing, and that is that we will be continuing with the series for a bit longer. In the first four episodes, I asked you guys to let me know in the comments if you wanted to see some more, and you guys have been really tremendous with the comments and the likes in terms of letting me know, hey, I want to see some more of this, Falcon. So you know what, guys? You got your wish. We will continue going forward with this for a bit longer over here. So again, thank you for the support and also for letting me know. Uh, second thing I wanted to cover before we get underway over here today, and this is a bit more just to kind of say thanks and give back a little bit to you guys as well for supporting me and the channel, whether it's views, likes, comments, etc. over the lifespan, and that is that I have a Steam group, which is always in my description below. I never pimp this out. I never, you know, do this to be like, hey guys, let me blow up my Steam group account number, because that's not really the case. And number two, there's obviously no sort of positive gain out of it for me, believe me. This is only for me to say thanks to you guys. And that is that in the Steam group, if you decide to join, again, completely optional, within this week and the next week, I'll be going ahead and dropping random keys for all of you guys. And these keys will be just game keys that I get sent by developers to cover their game on the channel, or just a bunch of extra, sometimes games I don't wind up covering at all. I can't really promise you, like, AAA titles because my channel is not really big. So instead of over here me just redeeming them for my own gain when I know I'm never going to play them, I'd rather just give them off to you guys. And I don't do this on the channel because I don't necessarily want people to subscribe to the channel just because I'm giving keys away. So I figure the best way to do this is through the Steam group because then it shows that you're taking an extra step to be part of the community. So again, this is all optional. Don't feel compelled to do it if you don't want to. It's perfectly fine. Anyway, let's get underway over here and we have a few things to do. Um, Cobbin actually sent me an email letting me know, or not even, it was a comment, message, something. But he let me know, Falcon, update your mod, because right now there is currently a bug in the Depths of Gaijus mod, which will actually break your game. So I went ahead and I updated that, so in case you guys are still on the 1.0 update, he released 1.01, I guess. And that has the fix to this uh, potentially game-breaking bug, so thank you for letting me know about that, Calvin, and all of you guys that have probably picked up the mod. Be sure to update, or else you might run into a bit of an issue here. Hopefully no creepy crawly pops up. I know there was a dogman over here that I was kind of yelling at last time when I was in here. My god, I was um, hyped out of my mind that day for some reason. It was either caffeine or I'm not sure what it was. It wasn't booze, I'll tell you that much. I have been... Well, actually, I had a little bit of a rambunctious weekend with that. And because of that, I want to lay off of that for a few days. It's kind of like when you wake up and you're like, Oh, I hate alcohol. Why do I do it? I'll never do it again. And then like a couple of days later, you're like... All right, let's have some fun and drink, you know? So that's kind of like the, mo the mood I'm in right now. Anyway, um, office building is in ruins. We're going to go ahead and use this torch over here instead of the um, lighter, because we might as well just waste this one because it's about to go out on us anyway. <laughs> oh, good God. <laughs> Almighty. This is a great start. I am so happy with the start now. Okay, <laughs> if you're not familiar with this, this is quite possibly the best um, vehicle you could actually make. I guess you could probably just make the variation without the boxes, but let me tell you, this right here is goddamn amazing. Okay, well, I know where you're going. You're coming over here, and we now have ourselves a box card. And we also have a duffel bag. You know what? This is quite amazing. Not only did I get the box card, I was so, you know enchanted with that idea that we also have a good bag now as well so we could say goodbye to this um, shopping bag over here and be like hey equip that oh yeah baby that's good stuff let's go ahead and do an auto rearrangement over here let's go ahead and empty out well let's actually start off by emptying out what's in the bag here what's in the bag it's my Brad Pitt impersonation instead of what's in the box though it's the bag so yeah okay thanks for clearing that out Falcon we didn't understand a, a really highly used um, quote from a really popular movie was that in the late 90s? No, early 2000s, right? 7 was in early 2000s, like maybe 2001. It's, it's been a while. Time flies by sometimes, man. And you realize, and you, like, for me, when I realize things have passed after a while, I'm like, really? That was like 10 years ago? What the fuck, man? It's just basically me coming to grips with the idea that I'm just getting older and older every single year. And it's, so again, one more year. Not to depress many of you watching right now, especially if you're young. If you're young, take advantage of it right now, man. Not that I'm saying I'm old as well, but let's be honest here. We're, we're starting to get to that point where, you know, I have a lot more responsibilities than I once did as a child. And things were great with no responsibilities. Once those things pop up and you have to, like, you know, 
take care of yourself like mon financially, then that's like, okay, well, yeah, it's not so easy anymore now, is it, Falcon? So I'm going to cover all these things over here. We have some dirty rags as well. We have some recipes. Let's go ahead and break these guys apart. We have the smudge stick. Smudge stick. Well, what, are you, what are you supposed to be? A uh, smudge stick. I have no idea what that is. Huh. Okay. And the plastic slug with strap. Oh, how convenient because it's right here. That is um convenient. All right. We also have another extra bottle. You know what? Let's actually grab this extra bottle right now. No reason not to do that. We'll just have an extra one over here. Fill this up with this dirty water. We'll try to... Sterilize it later? Where'd that go? <laughs> where did that... Excuse me? Okay. Um... Not really what I was trying to do right now, but sure, I guess. Ooh, what do you found over here? Where, where, where did that water go? Did you guys see that? I just double clicked on it to hopefully make it come in here, but apparently just went in. Did you drink it? You better not have drank that straight up, dog. That's no good. Where's this water at? Yo. Yo, 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 my friend. Did you go in here? Not sure where the hell that thing went. Things happen sometimes in this game. I'm like, wait a minute. Way to darn tootin. Did you probably, maybe you stocked up with the other one that was, maybe that's what happened. I don't know. I I'm confused right now. Anyway, uh, water, we got some pants, but I'm going to hold on to my cargo pants because they have more carrying capacity. Hoodies at 15.6, this one at 0.9. I think the one that we have is actually a lot better and those guys not a big problem there. Don't need these shoes, we have some boots, so everything over here is fine for the most part. I do want to grab this tin foil though, let's go ahead and do some rearrangement over here. And long string is not a bad thing as well. So we'll cover that as well, and we want this for a fact. And at some point we have to start doing the rearrangement over here as well. That shouldn't be too bad, I don't think, anyway. As a matter of fact, let's just do that now. Let's go ahead and empty this all out here. Oh, good God, it just went everywhere. Uh, tin foil, we'll have you hang out over here. We'll have... Chunk is at 37.7. Guys, remind me to eat this before it spoils like the other one did. We have a trap, that's obviously something we always want. Eh, we'll go ahead and take this, too. I guess we could just double-click stuff like this. It'll be easier, right? And then I'll just do, like, an auto-rearrangement, and it'll probably take care of itself. Meh. Maybe that's what'll happen. And, obviously, we want this as well. Sticks, we want these bad boys as well, so we could always make fires in the fly, and not have to worry about going through a wooded area to find some. That's pretty good. Uh, you guys are always so around, so I could stoke fires and whatnot, so we'll take some more parts over here, more parts. We will take string, and we will take some of these guys as well to start making my fires on the fly. Relatively good. More string, dirty rags, I'll clean you guys over at some point. An extra bottle as well. We'll probably put you with the other um, bottles though, so we'll save you for that one. And we have 97.3, might as well pick this up too. And I think that's about it, right? Well, take this as well. I guess we had this over here for selling at some point, so I'll pick this up. And bottle, I'll take care of you pretty soon. Let's do an auto rearrangement over here. Is this good? Eh, it'll have to do for now. Okay, and let's go back to my regular inventory over here. And, ooh, we should have the room for the bottle right now, as a matter of fact. And there you go. Perfect. So over here we have bullets, we have gummy bears, and everything else seems pretty fine for the most part. Yeah. Okay, this is really amazing. I'm so glad we got that box card. Okay. And our torch obviously went to pieces. Uh, I was told by Kevin that I should just focus on making the quality torches, which is um, will last me a bit longer than my crude ones, which does make sense. I guess what I'll do is I'll start focusing on the quality ones once we get rid of the uh, crude ones, though. And that would probably even itself out. You come over here, and that's about it. We have one more area to explore, don't we? Yes, we do. Uh, let's check out the destroyed office building over here. Let's just use the lighter for now. Oh my god. <laughs> the hits just keep on coming, don't they? We have some makeshift racks, which aren't really too bad, especially to carry by hand. Um, as you can see, that's definitely a lot to carry around with right there. Hmm. Oh my goodness god, I forgot that you could put the backpack and the duffel bags its own little entire thing. Jesus, this has been quite an amazing haul for us, hasn't it? And I guess for now, I'd be kind of really foolish not to just carry this by hand. Although, I can't place you anywhere else. Can I place you in the, in the car? I could place you in the car. I'm going to keep my hand free just because I want to have this for the torch, but um, yeah, at least we have that as a backup. You're 20.8 and you are what? 63. So we'll keep on this one and that's about it. And in terms of the dirty rags, we will probably pick up a few more of these so we can sanitize them and use them whenever we need them. Alrighty, that's actually quite great. How did I leave you out here? Maybe, you just, maybe I just found you right now. Do another auto rearrangement, that's pretty good. Okay. 
Excellent stuff. Is there anything else over here to check out? Because this has been the landmine of items here so far. I think there's probably one more chick um, thing to go through. Let's end our turn. Everything else seems pretty good. Stated hunger. Thirst. Rested. Yeah, we're looking really quite amazing right now, as a matter of fact. Let's go ahead and make ourselves this torch if we can. Or, not really a torch, we just need to light it up. So... Where is crew torch lid? We'll use the lighter now to turn this on, so no no need to actually make a campfire now. We could easily just turn these on now a lot easier. So that's actually quite good to see. Equip you. And we should have one more area to check through here, which should be this uh, storage shed. Use the torch. No useful items were found. Alrighty, well, I'm still not upset about this because this was an overall amazing haul, I would probably say. Alrighty. Facility's still up there. I still want to find that crowbar. I'm surprised we have not found one single crowbar yet. It's actually quite amazing to me. Again, as Kevin said, it's not really required, but there's a few locations in the Gaijus facility that do require it, so I'd rather just have it there in one go as opposed to having to come back later on afterwards as well. Let's come over here to this little small city and find out what's happening in here. And ba -ba -ba -ba, we'll continue using our torch over here. Oop. Oh my god. This game loves me right now. I think the game itself is happy that I'm back to playing it. It's kind of like, all right, Falcon, um, I'm going to treat you well. Play me a bit longer. And you know what, game? You got it. Let's go ahead and eat these chips here for now. We have this. We'll turn this into foil pretty soon. We might as well... Yeah, I'll, I'll take the Twinkie with me. I'm not going to eat it right now. First aid kit, we already have this one. As a matter of fact, we could even get the items out of there. But I'll just keep at least one of these containers here for now. I suppose if I wanted to be more MOG about it, I should carry the one that's at 99%. Not really necessary, but, you know, let's just do it. We have some ketchup over here as well. You can just probably hang out over here. We need to break you down. Any more spots for string? Yeah. The string just went into that bottle. Huh. All right. Well, I mean, I didn't really want you there, actually, but uh, let's, let's place you over here. Okay. More dirty rags. I think we're fine with those now. We could do this and just move the rest of you guys over here. I have a lot of string. I don't even need all this, but I have so much carrying potential now. I might as well take advantage of it. And let's go ahead and break down this rag if we... Or not the rag, but the tinfoil bag itself. Perfect. This will be for our tinfoil suit down the line as well. And you should have a spot right here. Oh, we could only carry up to 24? No, 30. 30 and then it breaks off into another pocket. That's fine. Let's see what else is over here available to us. A straight office building. We'll use our torch. More rags, another bottle as well. You know what, another bottle would not be too bad. Let's move my burning canister over here, or like my, not burning canister, but my canister that I used to purify my water. We'll pick you up and place you over here. That's fine, we also have some dirty water. We'll take you along for now too. Um, yeah, you need to come out of there, my friend. You're gonna confuse me down the line. There you go. Okay, and as a matter of fact, let's empty you out if we can, and I'd rather just fill this up in line. Perfect. And we have one more to check out, or was that it? Well, even if we do, which we do, we still have to end our turn right now, so let's do that one right now. Oh! Feral Dong? I saw a guy with a shotgun, too. What if that's the guy who owned that box card, and he's over here to pick it up, and he's like, Oh my god, it's gone, and he comes after me with, like, the, the wrath of a god over here, just pissed off out of his mind. Our... Torches went out, as you guys noticed, more than likely. Let's go ahead over here and turn on one of the back ones that we have here. Lit. Where's the quality one? See, we don't have the recipe for the quality one, so I do believe I have to make that one myself or find the recipe to figure it out. Quality, yeah. See, there's no quality torch. It's only the uh, crude one, which is one reason why I was actually using that one. So I guess I'll just have to make the quality one myself. I think I know how to do that, so it should be fine. But for now, we might as well just use up the crude ones anyway. Alright, this is good. Nope. Oh, right. Get out of here, stink! We don't need you anymore. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and search to this abandoned apartment building over here. Use the old torchy poo. And we... Act our activity uh, likely alerted nearby creatures, and nothing useful was found. Let's go ahead and jump into this one over here. And let's do some more scavenging about. Let's go through the... Office towers first. They've been pretty good to us here so far. Not that one, though. Let's go through this one right here as well. Nothing over there. We have one more turn. Luckily, no injuries have been happening right now due to our scavenging. Let's not go ahead and jinx it, though, huh, Falcon? We have a right tact. Ooh. 85.4. You are at 85.2. Oh, baby! We have matching boots now, too. <laughs> this run is going great. I'm so glad we're playing this game again. Everything's just going so slow right now. Let's go ahead and stock you over here as well. Okay, everything's good so far. 
We have some more tin foil. Might as well pick this up. Excuse me, can you just, um, yeah, hang out with your friends over here? And binos, these are about to break down, so their value's pretty low. The only reason I'm keeping this around is to sell it off once we go to DMC, so... For now, we'll just make do with this one. That's gonna be our turn, we'll end it right here. Something that I had on... Oh, my, my torch fell apart. That's fine. I expect them to fall apart anyway. Let's go into... Ba -ba 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 -ba. Light you up. Get on out of here. Okay. We have one more building to go through over here. We'll use that again. Found some more stuff yet again. More water and more bottles as well. I think five bottles is more than enough, but let's just go ahead and make six because we have the option to do so. We can just move these bags over here again. Not a big deal. Might want to pick up that extra bottle as well, but I think six is probably more than enough. Everything else seems about overkill at this point. But, you know... Never a bad thing to have an extra one. So for now, I will say yes. We'll pick you up and place you right here. You can come over here and join. Oh, you don't want to be part of the group again. I'm not sure what the hell's... <laughs> no, I went on to the next one. These waters don't ever want to mingle each with each other anymore. Even though they're both, like, you know, unsanitary waters. They're like, no, no, no. Don't place me with that dirty water, Falcon. I'm my own dirty water. They have, like, individualities now, too, to themselves. Uh, let's see. Can we stock any more of these bad boys here? No, it only goes up to three, huh? I think three is more than enough, but since we have extra room right now, we might as well take advantage of it. You're the broken one, and that's about it here, right? And might as well grab the rest of this string here. And you over here. Okay, that's good. Good stuff. We'll leave our shoe behind, and are we done here? Yeah, we're done finding stuff over here as well. Alrighty, so, still no crowbar, though. We have 3.90 moves left over, so that's going to help us out. Just do some... Traveling about here at nighttime, we just ran into a creature, though. Or just another person. Hopefully a person that doesn't want to kill me. Let's go ahead and scan the area. Player searches for unknown target. I'm, I'm not sure if I'm visible to them as well, so that worries me a little bit here. So we'll just continue searching around. Apparently I could do a blind attack, but I'd rather not do that. Let's just go ahead and continue searching. It's a feral dog. And he's actually coming towards me. He's frail and vulnerable. He is charging towards me. He's up close and personal now. So, what I'm going to do here is, let's see if we can just dodge this attack here, momentarily. He ran from me now. So, he's at a three range away. Let's go ahead and do a melee attack because we have the spear here. Let's see, he dodged my attack, so I completely whiffed on that one. I will be exposed easy for an attack at the moment, but he still has to run back towards me again. So, let's go ahead for another melee attack, and we got him this time around. Uh, Feral Dog is stunned and able to move for a moment. We tore his upper left arm with a broad spear stab. He is now bleeding. And he should be charging at me as well. Uh, let's go ahead and see if we could probably parry his next attack here. Player parries Feral Dog's move. He's bleeding. Nice. Making him hard to hit for a moment. Okay, now let's go ahead for another melee attack over here. I missed that one this time. He also dodged that one. Good on you. Good on you. Let's do another melee. Okay, we got his right arm. And he's having trouble concentrating. He should be going down pretty soon. He's trying to threaten me, this guy. Got a lot of nerve trying to threaten me. After I'm over here jacking him up. Jacking him up and not jacking him off. That would be completely terrible. And dirty. And why would I do that? It's not a red rocket situation over here, I assure you. Uh, alrighty. So let's go ahead and do another melee attack as well. Moved. I missed that one. Let's see if we could just lure him. Feral dog passed out from unbearable pain. <laughs> so now we just advance and we will basically just kill this dude. And more than likely... I guess we could just kill him and get some food off of him for that as well. Let's see here. Open field. Let's use our botany skill as well. Nothing useful was found. That was the rest of our turns right here. The body's going to be hanging out right here. I think it should be fine for the next turn. We will try to take care of this doggy man afterwards. I'm a bit thirsty now, though. Not a big problem. Doggy man is still hanging out over here. Alrighty, we're going to go ahead and um, cut this guy down for some food next episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up. Leave a like. This support us me a lot. And uh, continue sticking around. And again, as I mentioned about the Steam group, be sure to join if you want. And to just join in and grab some free keys that I'll be tossing in here um, over this week or so. I will catch you next time.